The WWE United States title is on the line, a title with so much history. Well, the winner almost becomes the defender of the red, white, and blue. Well, that is, unless they choose to use the title to insult Americans, as somehow. Hey, it's the title holder's freedom to do so, Saxton. Trying to catch him off guard with that attempt. Landing on top of the skull. Penny predicament. Two. And he got a near fall out of it. Almost got it done so soon. Dropkick hits hard, lands harder. From the top. Whoa, what a landing. And after that, you know things have just kicked up a notch. Pedal to the metal right now. Let me give out some free advice for when you're clashing with a mastermind like Seth Rollins. You have to be disruptive. Seth came into the ring tonight with a plan, so do everything you can to upset it. Don't play his game and let him control the tempo of the match. That's how you take Rollins down. That sounds like a good strategy, Corey. And if things aren't going Seth's way, that'll probably only drive him off balance and make him easier to contend with. We'll slide back in the ring now. Rollins getting worked on here. This is what I was talking about, doing everything possible to disrupt Seth's master plan for this match. And Rollins capitalizes. Quick exchange of counters there. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Oh, what a bump to the face! Uncorks another one. Wasting absolutely no respect on his opponent. You gotta love it. He's got the target acquired. Just a matter of moments. Just like that, Rollins dodges. He reverses it. Pump kick. And Theory is keeping the match at his pace. Yeah, Rollins has hit a roadblock here. Oh, this is a great move, the Brain Buster! Looking for the victory! Two! It's over! The reign is over! Now let's look back at that amazing action. Here is your winner, and the new WWE United States Champion, Austin Theory. What a shift into the tides with this championship match. To go from challenger to champion, that has to feel good.